Hi, my name is Bob Belisles. I'm the Vice President of Enterprise Business Development with Hirsch Electronics. Today we're going to talk a little bit about the PACE Gateway from Hirsch that we're really showing for the first time at this show. As you can see here, the PACE Gateway ties physical events and makes them triggers for network responses. And conversely, we can take a network event and now trigger a physical system response with it. So let's go through the demo real quick here and I'll show you how it kind of works. So in this particular example, we're going to say that we're going to trigger the physical presence of an individual badging into the building is going to become a prerequisite or a requirement for logging onto the network. So as with most business days, we're going to start out. I'm going to get to the front of the door. I'm going to badge in at the, this entry point here. That information now displays up on this physical security system that uses the IFMAP protocol developed by the Trusted Computing Group. And that protocol basically shares the physical event information with a metadata access point, a clearinghouse for, in, for metadata of all sorts that comes off of different network devices. That information in turn is communicated to a network access control appliance that then enforces the policies and then tells other networked resources how to respond. So in this case, what we've done is we've now said that Bob Belisles has badged into the building. That information has gone to the network. The network access control appliance now matches that up and says, great, when he logs in, I'll go ahead and grant him access or deny access if he didn't badge in. So now we can move on over here. I'm in my office now. I'm going to go ahead and log in at the beginning of the day. And right now you can see over here, even though it's, it looks static, that we have a, uh, a repeating ping to an outside device. This mimics basically our connection to the internet. I'm going to go ahead and log into the, and right now it's basically saying we have no connection to the internet. I'm going to rectify that problem by logging in here. Right now the policy is being checked. I'm inside the building. My username and password matched. Also the health of the device matched. And now you can see that I have been granted network access because I have met all of the criteria for being granted access. Now I'm going to make do something that most people also do during the business day. I'm going to leave for lunch, but I'm going to leave for lunch without logging out on the network, which creates an IT security uh, compliance problem. But I am going to badge out. So I've gone ahead and badged out. Similarly, we go through the same process we did before. In a moment, you're going to see the network is timed out. And in fact, the logon screen here has changed and now says Hirsch Electronics Velocity reports that you are in an outside location. So even though I didn't log out, the physical event of me log logging out actually triggered the network response to take me off the network. And this could, of course, triggered us to go onto a VPN concentration connection now that I'm outside of the building. Or conversely, if I came in, terminate that VPN. So you can see here that we can use physical presence as now a new policy for gaining or denying access to various network resources. And by the same token, we can take any physical event, a breach, alarm, a fire, and now the network can respond to those types of events that before it had no awareness of.